Woof woof! Hey guys, it's me Marcus, aka The Mad Dog, and we're back with another video. This one's going to be a little bit different because a few weeks ago, Louie over at joblockcomics.co.uk sent me a message asking if I could open one of his boxes on my channel. He was kind enough to send this across to me, and I'm really thankful for that. The website's going to be down below if you want to order one yourself. But they're based in the UK, and they're just starting up, so I really wanted to support them, and they asked me if I wanted some free comics, and I was like... Yes. So here today we're just going to open it up and obviously I have to say this as a disclaimer, please do not use scissors unless you're a trained professional. Now, am I going to open this? I'm not really sure. For once as well, I'm actually going to move the camera down. So here we go. So hopefully now you can see a bit more clear. I'm just going to get this opened. I'm not going to lie, they package this really well. Like I am struggling to open this up. This might end up just being the video. It might just be me trying to open a box. Okay, so starting off, we've got a poster right here. Some good DC content right there. And also you've got a checklist of all the comics that came out recently. We've got some information about the website right there. Obviously there's going to be information down below. So in each of these boxes, you get 15 comics and there's some from Marvel, there's some from DC and you get them for just $12.99, including delivery. And as well, some of these boxes also have bonus books. So they've got Silver Age, a Bronze Age comics, and there's also variants so it seems quite good value for money as well we've got a nice little playing card from the three jokers promotion that went on recently but now the bit that you've all been waiting for the actual comics that come in the box as well just seeing these here we've got some badges we've got some little pins i've got a hulk one right there that i accidentally just dropped and we've also got a batman one so that's pretty cool packaged really well like i said this is a company that's just started up so i think now's the time when we really have to be supporting companies that you know we're trying to do things a little bit differently okay so this is a stack of comics you get quite a good stack of them so i'm just going to go through them one by one the first one is the savage avengers issue one we've also got the savage avengers issue two which is a title that i actually really wanted to pick up you've got the recent first issue of morbius the living vampire i've got the first issue of event leviathan as well you've got harley quinn's villain of the year these are all really recent comics this is quite a good value for money you've got the 80 page flash issue 750 that's pretty cool there is some really good stuff in here. You've got the Uncanny X-Men issue 3. I've got an Action Comics 1018. I've got Doomsday Clock issue 10. I've got Immortal Hulk issue 22 and that's quite convenient because I think the second hardcover finished at issue 21 so I might be able to jump onto single issues now. We've got an issue of Jerry Dugan's The Marauders which I've heard really good things about and we've got a variant cover for the Aquaman 52 Year of the Villain tie-in. That's a really nice variant cover as well. He looks like how I looked when I realised how much I'd spent on comics last year. I really like this next cover. It's from Bendis' Superman run. That's really cool. Like, I'm looking forward to reading this entire run because of the fact that I've heard mixed things about it. We've got the epilogue to Marvels, and this feels like really good quality as well. As well, I have to say that all these books have come in really good condition. Like, you can tell this is a company that was started up by collectors for collectors, so I really appreciate that. And the last book that I've got is the second annual for Batman Detective Comics by Peter J. Tomasi. So, I've moved the camera back up, so in total I got 15 comics in there, and like I said, these boxes go for only $12.99, and that's including delivery. That works out to about 86 pence per comic and obviously you've got the chance for there to be some Silver Age and some Bronze Age comics in there. I had a variant cover in there as well. You get at least a couple of first issues for a series so it's not just that you're getting a load of random issues in the middle of a run but the ones that you do get that are later in a series are titles that you already know so it's not the case that you're going to feel like you're left out or anything like that. And I know that most people in the UK say that they're disappointed that there aren't more companies that are trying to do more for the comic collectors over here. Well now we've got one that is trying to do things a little bit different. Differently. So for less than the price of some trade paperbacks, you can get one of these boxes, you can get a load of new series that you might be introduced to, and you've also got a chance of maybe getting a rare comic. So I definitely recommend checking them out. Their link's going to be down below, and I'd also like to just thank Louie once again for sending me one of the boxes. It was really appreciated, and also it just makes me think that maybe I am doing something good with this channel. I don't know, I'm always my own biggest critic, so it just feels like maybe I'm doing something right. But make sure that you check out Joblock Comics' website in the link down below, and make sure you tell them that the Mad Dog sent you. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't like this video, why did you get this far? Leave a comment and show some support of Job Lot of Comics. Even if it is that you can't buy one right now, just show them some love. Show them that you appreciate that the UK is finally getting some attention. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you get your paws all over that subscribe button so that you can become part of the Dog Pound and click the bell notification so that you never miss a video. Check out some of my social media links. And as well, we've got our own Reddit page, r slash community. I've got Amazon affiliate links down below if you want to support the channel. It is greatly appreciated. But until the next video, just make sure that you stay safe, stay reading the best books that you can find, and stay mad all you dogs. Woof woof! See you at the next video.